Hi guys, this is Dan from The Investment ABC, your guide to financial freedom. And in this video, I want to present you a very interesting company called Schrodinger Inc. The company was founded in 1990 and is a life sciences technology company that is focused on finding drug compounds at a lower price and way faster than the competition. The company is claiming that its software is evaluating billions of molecules per week with a higher degree of accuracy compared to traditional pharma with thousands of compounds a year. Not only that they are able to discover the compounds much faster, but they can do it at a lower cost and with a higher likelihood of success. On the website, Schrodinger states that, quote, traditional pharma approaches to drug discovery synthesizes thousand compounds a year. Our physics-based platform evaluates billions of molecules per week with a high degree of accuracy. To me, that is a huge difference between Schrodinger's platform and the conventional approach. Unfortunately, I am neither a scientist nor a computer specialist to understand if the claims are true or not. But what I like is that Schrodinger is backed by Bill Gates and Google Ventures, which both have expertise and computational power to judge Schrodinger's platform. Though Schrodinger is not the only company using AI and machine learning to speed up drug discovery, its software can also help to accelerate the development of new materials in industries like aerospace, energy, semiconductors and electronic displays. Currently, the company has six drugs in its pipeline, which are mostly against cancer. Three of them are in collaboration with Bristol Myers Squibb. Furthermore, Schrödinger has a broad pipeline of collaborative programs from which the company will earn royalty revenues. Two drugs in collaboration with Agios are already FDA approved and Schrödinger is collecting royalties from the sales. Furthermore, Schrödinger has equity positions in many companies they have collaborations with. The upside on royalties and the equity stakes alone could be a huge revenue generator in the coming years. Just imagine that one or two companies Schrödinger has a stake in develops a blockbuster drug. Furthermore, there could be many more potential collaborations down the road for Schrödinger with companies using their platform. If we have a look at the financials, we can see that the total revenue increased from 66.6 .6 million US dollar in 2018 to 108.1 million US dollar in 2020. The blue bar is the software revenue, which increased 39% year over year in 2020. On the other hand, the orange bar, which is the drug discovery revenue, decreased by around 17%. Revenue from drug discovery is still not steady because there are a lot of one-time payments, for example, milestones, achievements. The company has a strong cash position with 643.2 million US dollar at the end of 2020. The company generated 16.8 million US dollar in net cash generated from operating activities. What is interesting is that gross margins were 80% in 2019 and 81% in 2020. So the company has a very profitable business model. Currently Schrödinger is investing a lot of money back into the company in form of R&D and general administrative expenses. This is also the reason why the operating loss was higher in 2020 with 60.9 million US dollar compared to 38.7 million US dollar in 2019. In March 2021, the share price of Schrödinger dropped from around 113 US dollar to around 72 dollar after releasing disappointing 2021 guidance. Total revenue is expected to grow by 15 to 31 percent in 2021. Software revenue is only growing by 10 to 19 percent, which is a bit disappointing for Wall Street. Schrödinger is saying that the majority of the growth will come in the um, fourth quarter of 2021. On the other hand, the drug discovery revenue will grow by 41 to 106 percent this year. The company is increasing its R&D expenses further and is also warning that operating losses will be higher than in 2020, while at the same time gross margins will be lower than 81 percent. So obviously the street didn't like the guidance and punished the stock. The stock currently is still richly valued with a market cap of 4.82 billion US dollar and revenues of 108.1 million in 2020. 
The price to sales multiple is a staggering 42. Investors think that the company will grow at a faster rate in the future to catch up with its market cap with such a high price to sales multiple. In my opinion, the company has good chances to really grow faster in the future, but it all depends on whether some of the compounds will grow into a blockbuster drug or not. What I like is that Schrödinger can grow its revenue steadily with its software business, which is having very high margins and use the cash flow to develop over time its own drug pipeline. Normally, biotech companies are very speculative because when you buy the stock of such a company, the risk is extremely high that drugs are failing and the company runs out of cash and needs to dilute existing shares over and over again to raise more capital. On the other hand, the reward is also extremely high once a biotech company develops a blockbuster drug. These drugs have the ability to generate more than a billion um, dollars in revenue per year and send the stock price to the moon. Schrödinger has the advantage to offer their AI-based platform to biotech or pharma companies to find better drug compounds at a faster pace. This stream of income is growing year over year and reducing the risk of running out of cash. Meanwhile, the company can develop slowly its own drug pipeline without worrying too much about cash like most other biotech companies. This is a huge advantage that gives Schrödinger the possibility to develop its own blockbuster over time. Even if the first potential drug fails, it is not bankrupting the company like many other biotechs. In my opinion, over time, the chances are good that the company will develop a blockbuster drug that could boost revenues and market cap significantly higher than the current market cap. I really like the company for its potential and bought a small core position. I will definitely add to my position during the next stock market crash or in a bear market when valuations come down again. Schrödinger is a company that should definitely be on your watch list in my opinion. So if you like this video, hit the like button to support the channel, comment, share and subscribe for more stock picks. Bye guys and see you in the next one.